because I love Montreal. It's like Paris, but you bathe. And it is just... <laughs> So nice to be here. Also, I just want to say, uh, every time I come here, I get very sentimental because I worked my first comedy clubs in Montreal. I used to live at the Y on Park Avenue. That makes yeah. And I worked in their coffee shop as a waitress to pay to go to all the comedy. And I, I and you were very generous because I found out if you limp, Montrealians give you extra tips. Oh, oh. So I would go to the Who can I help you? Yeah. <laughs> and I would say, I'll get the ketchup, don't worry. And they'd say, can we help you, miss? No, no, I'm working my way through college. It's fine, it's fine. What do you want to be, miss? Ballerina! And it's like... <laughs> And yeah, I'm here, and I'm thrilled to be here, and I'm, well, I'm thrilled to be any place north of Mexico. It is, oh! <laughs> I just went to Mexico. I have a grandson who is macho, and he wanted to swim with sharks. $250 to swim with sharks. Do you understand what I'm telling you? I went over to the fattest woman I could find, and I said, I hope you have your period. It is, oh! <laughs> minute of it, and, I, and uh, please don't take offense if any of you happen to be from there, because I'm sure you're very nice people, but ugly, they are the, uh, uh, Mexican, oh, 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 5,000 people, no, Mexicans are, all right, I want to show of hands, I want to show of hands, how many people in this auditorium have ever seen a picture of a Mexican in a magazine, and you ripped it out, you brought it to your plastic surgeon, and you said, make me look like this. <laughs> And they're stupid. They is just... No, they hit pinatas. They have those big they, blah, 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 that adult people standing there. I'm gonna get a piece of candy out of this. I would understand if green cards came out. That that I would that... Anyhow, so I'm thrilled to be here with you, and I came on Air Canada, and they were very, very nice. I want you to know that. But I had two children behind me. The, oh, don't start. Children on planes, I'm so, you're sitting there, it's a six hour trip. I got these little children behind me. Ah, uh, lady, lady. Where is Casey Anthony when you need her? It is. You know who I'm really sick of? Can we talk here for a second? You know who I'm really sick of? Taylor Swift. <laughs> my boyfriend's left me, my boyfriend's left. Nine guys in nine months. Figure out why, you dumb bitch, why? <laughs> she doesn't douche. I'm gonna tell you that she doesn't douche. If I were her mother, I would say, put down the pen and take a sniff. That's what they're... <laughs> uh, Adele <laughs> is suing me. Miss Butter Queen, she is suing me. You said I was fat. She wants an apology. She wants me to take out a big billboard and say, I'm really sorry. I said, I'm not taking out a billboard. I'll write it on your big ass. And it's just... <laughs> Montreal. Thank you. Miley Cyrus. Uh, I was a virgin until I was 16 because your brother can't run fast enough. I, I'm sorry. You, you know, I'm not here to complain. <laughs> you can tell. I'm here to wish you all very well because uh, Kate Middleton had the baby and I congratulate you on that. And it's about time she was pregnant 375 months. I, I, that kid came out shaving. I have never, it's like, and I like her. I really like, I didn't like Diana. Watch everyone get quiet. Watch the gay men get quiet. <laughs> gay men, I see two in front here. <laughs> Either that or strong women. I see. <laughs> you can never say anything to gay men either about Barbara Streisand being ugly. Look at them. 
or uh, uh, Princess Diana, I hated her. And you know why I didn't like her? Because she didn't know when the good times were with her. If you don't know when the good times are with you guys, you are stupid. She, I'm not happy. I'm not ha Kate Middleton's happy. Diana, not happy, not happy, not happy, not happy. She was tall, she was thin, she was gorgeous, she was young, she was rich. She had a husband who didn't want to sleep with her. She, she, oh! She had a crown. You don't know what I'm talking about. She had a crown. Do you understand if you had a crown, you could go back to any class reunion for the rest of your life? <laughs> that all those guys that didn't vote for you for student council, when you come to the reunion, you say, they said, yeah, how you doing? You say, check my hat. That's how I'm doing better than you. That's a, and Princess, uh, which I love, uh, she got Princess Diana's ring. <laughs> Would you give your mother's ring to your woman? You, darling, I love you very much. I want you to have my mother's engagement ring. My mother and father hated each other from the very beginning. <laughs> they both f***ed everybody else they could find in sight. They say my brother doesn't belong to my father. My mother threw herself down the stairs and they killed her in Paris. Good luck. a Jew, I wouldn't take that ring. It, well, well, I would take it, but I wouldn't make a bracelet. It, <laughs> that's true. I'm thrilled you're here. I am thrilled to be here. And so let's get right to it, okay? <laughs> And this was her argument. She goes, what if one of those illegal immigrants that we see in the neighborhood tries to break into the house and rape me? I'm like, what do your fantasies have to do with this? <laughs> Never hear your fat friend say something like, no, I really shouldn't. <laughs> you walk with your fat friend, middle of the night, you wanna stop for some pizza? Hell yeah.